So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to the link, which will be down below in the description. We're gonna be downloading Java. Click on download Java. And I'll click on download Java again. Now it's installing. And I'll click on the download. Click on yes. And then click on install. Wait for this to load. And then click on close. And now for the second step, you're gonna head over to search and type in view advanced system settings. Click on it. And now this will come up. And now once you're on this, make sure you're on the advanced tab and then click on environment variables. And then click on new. And now for variable name, you can just call it anything. I'm just gonna be calling it Java. And now for variable value, you wanna click on the box and then click on browse file. And now once you're on this on the left hand side, you wanna scroll down and click on this PC. And now you wanna click on the drive where you have Windows installed on. It's gonna have the Windows logo on it. That's how you know it's the correct one. You wanna double click on it. And then click on program files. And then click on Java. And then click on JRE. And then click on VIN. And now once you're here, you wanna scroll down till you see Java. Scroll down till you see Java. Yeah, so you wanna get Java right here. Make sure that it's not like Java CPL or anything like that. Just make sure that it just says Java only. So you wanna click on this and then click on open. And then click on okay. Click on okay again. Okay again. Now you just wanna restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed. 